Today we will learn about how data is analyzed in a lab. There are two types of data. One type of data is known as qualitative data. And qualitative data is observations and descriptions that are made during an experiment. So for example, if I said that a plant has red flowers, that would be an example of a qualitative observation. The other type of data is quantitative. And quantitative data is numerical. So for example, if I said that the plant has five red flowers, that would be an example of quantitative data. Quantitative data can be broken up into either discrete or continuous data. Discrete data is the result of a count. So for example, if I have a plot and I have plants in the pot, plot, we see that I have one, two, three, four, five, six, six plants. That is a discrete um, measurement. Continuous is usually the result of some measurement that is made. So for example, if I have a flower and I measure the height of the flower, I might record the measurement as five centimeters. However, someone else measuring the plant might report it as 5.1 centimeters. So most likely the measurement of the plant is somewhere between 5 and 5.1 centimeters. That is an example of continuous data. Two, other ex two examples of continuous data that is typically um, used in a lab is time, length, Discrete data can also be divided up into uh, cate categories, and that is known as categorical data. So for example, if I was counting the color of plants in a plot, I could write a table and then measure how many red plants there were, how many yellow plants there were, and how many green plants there were. 